dear viewers, welcome to this reading. This reading is for all Capricorns and it's for now. What you need to know, Capricorn, right now, everything you need to know, and you can use this timeless anytime, and I'll be making regular ones regularly so that you can click on anyone, and it's exactly what you need to know right now, and it can be anytime. It's timeless. So let us begin to see what are the most important factors for all Capricorn to know right now. Starting with the first message here, it says the wall. I need my glasses for this. I'll just have a look. The wall is all about misunderstandings. There are misunderstandings that you need to clarify, that you need to talk about and find what is the best way to make yourself understandable or vice versa if it's somebody else. The four leaf clover is about great fortune, good luck coming your way, my dear Capricorn. Wow, look at your money reading. This is really good. Exquisite. Let's have a look at two important messages for all Capricorn for right now. We've got the first one and it's miracles. Wow. Miracles are going to be pouring in and look at that, the clever. So whatever misunderstanding there, there is, it's just going to disappear with this much great fortune coming your way and extreme luck. Luck does help remove problems. So that's that one. And then I'm going to take one more message for all Capricorn for right now. You've got courage. You are going to be given all the strength and all the courage to move forward. I feel a lot of transformations are taking place right now, and it is connected with family. Some of you could be connected with, with education or rising your vibrations and your wisdom, but I do feel like um, things are going to get much better for you. Let's take two, a few more tarot cards from different decks. For all Capricorn right now, I'm going to take four messages here. I'll put it over here so you can see. So we'll start with the first one. And we've got the Knight of Pentacles. This shows that you're working very hard or dealing with someone that's working very hard. We'll find out more as we go along. We've got the King of Swords, which shows someone of air energy could be there supporting you, being very brutally honest and maybe a little bit ruthless with the truth. Someone of air energy, Aquarius, Gemini, Libra. This is Earth energy like yourself, my dear Capricorn. It could be someone working alongside you. Um, Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. This is also about, it has another meaning. It, it means that you are going to see things so clearly to the point of no return. You won't be able to go back. Seeing the truth to the highest level and having the clarity to move forward. So that's really good. Okay, let's take two more messages from another deck. All Capricorn. We've got the light bulb, which is great. Great ideas and lucrative idea. A new source of income that might give you... Um, uh, a new idea, a new source of income uh, where there, there may be a business. You might be thinking of doing your own business. Okay, lucrative ideas, a new income source, inspiration, the light bulb. It's also about, uh, about entrepreneurship, working on your, working for yourself. It could be a new job or a creative kind of work. Now, with this um, golden cutlery shows that it could be your business. You need business tools, um, needing more money, perhaps living well living exceptionally well and it could be in regard to careers to food related careers um, if you're a sole provider you'll be doing exceptionally well more work and perhaps your own business okay that's very interesting okay let's take two more messages one has just fallen which is the page of wands and the page of wands shows a new person or a new idea entering your life that's going to be very uh, prosperous someone of fire energy could be entering your life or starting to work with you or you might be working alongside a partnership with someone of fire energy Sagittarius Aries Leo we'll find out more as we go along All right well we have the world there is a chapter that's ending some of you are going to be traveling some of you will be very happy with this chapter that's ending because you're elevated to high levels of consciousness to high levels of status where there's been there'll be more money coming into your life that's wonderful. What else we need to know? You're leaving an unhappy situation, leaving it behind and moving forward. And finally, I'll take one more. We've got two of cups, a partnership made in heaven. Someone from your past life unites with you where you will heal together, become strong together and walk hand in hand. Wow, that is beautiful. Good to know. Right, that's that. Now, I do want to take uh, two more cards from this deck. Or th okay, one more challenge and something is coming to an end. This is where you're leaving. There'll be an ending. Uh, a challenging situation ends. And I'll take just one more, two more maybe. There is a situation where you've wanted to leave. You've wanted to resolve it long time ago, but you were procrastinating. Maybe you don't want to hurt somebody. You let them 
stay on but it's finally coming to an end and just one more to put it into this being uh, torn between two situations not knowing where to go or how to proceed there'll be great news coming to take you to the next level I'll take one more from this deck to see is there anything left that we're not sure about right the moon actually I might take two the moon right there it is again the Knight of Pentacles, what we had from the beginning, that has doubled up. I'll talk about that in a moment. The moon shows that there are hidden matters. There will be a lot of revelations. Secrets are going to be exposed. You'll finally see your path clearly. Something to do with someone that has cancer within them. And seeing, empowered by seeing uh, situations very clearly. Now, I'll put this one over here and look at this. You've got the Knight of Pentacles. I feel like the Knight of Pentacles, someone who is very hard worker, someone wonderful, you'll be working together in team. It could be the soulmate person or partnership, someone like yourself who is hard worker, someone that in hand in hand you are very strong together. I feel like this is someone that might be entering your life. They could have fire energy within them. It is possible. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo. Or they could be earth energy like yourself, um, Virgo, Capricorn. I am Taurus, so that's that one. Now let's see what else you need to know. I'm gonna take some more uh, messages from here. Two messages from this for all Capricorn right now. Okay, so we've got one, and oh my goodness, it shows Aries. I'll talk about that in a moment. And there's some more messages here. All right, uh, Aries. Remember, I said someone new entering your life. It could be. This uh, fire energy could be Aries. We've got Aries here. Now, Aries is a fire energy. And I'll put my glasses on so I can tell you all about this. Um, there could be someone you're dealing with that's Aries. Very strong fire energy. Or there could be... Um, it says within seven days you'll get to know. This is the Emperor. This is about power and control over your your life, your destiny. I also feel like this is to do with someone wanting independence, someone aggressive. Um someone who, who wants to lead the situation there could be um um assertiveness someone like taking a stand and saying you know i, uh, you know, I want to do this my way um i also see that something's happening within seven days that's for sure and you've got four so um it could be up to four weeks seven days four weeks the emperor empowerment and aries okay let's have a look at this one it says you're rising like the phoenix and um, death and rebirth, this is about something ending and a new beginning, just like we have the world, end of a chapter, awakening, um, rising above all, and um, total transformations, and complete of a chapter and renewal. This is happening within two to five months, for all, two to five days to months, uh, for all Capricorn going through this, and you need to know this right now. Connected to the letter A, connected to um, Taurus, Aries, as in star signs, and also um, uh, Capricorn and Pisces. It is connected to Chinese Year of the Buffalo, Chinese Year of the Horse, and Chinese Year of the Dragon. This Year of the Dragon 2024 is gonna impact you. You'll be rising again and rising and doing well. The Moose is about imposing, somebody imposing their power or their strength or their, um, on somebody else, their attitude. Um, and it's also about being independent. And wanting time alone, somebody wanting time alone, it could be yourself or somebody that you're dealing with. Uh, it is about calmness, um, attitude is everything, knowing how to deal with people, how to talk to people, how to be sort of more um, confident in, in your way. Um, and, and also it is about um, overcoming a major challenge. The letter A is there again, Antarctica, we've got A twice here, A, A. So somebody that has initials A, I feel like um, you're overcoming a challenge. Chinese Year of the Monkey, September, something big happening in September. Good to know now, uh, all this now. Now, let's have a look at two more messages from this deck. For all Capricorn right now, we got one. And we need one more. This is sticking out, it won't go in, so it must be that. All right, let's have a look what you need to know right now. And we've got, I feel the chemistry between us. We need to trust. We need to trust that the energy we share will bring us back together again. Chinese Year of the Gold. This is about someone that has Leo in them and Virgo, either one. August. Something about August or eight days from now. And 
um, we've got, I'm, I'm looking for a way out of this situation so I can be free. Somebody wants to be free. It looks like a lot of changes are going to take place to take you to the next level. This year, the year of the dragon, is going to take you out. And five days from the time you see this, up to five weeks uh, from the time you see this reading, it's connected to people that have Taurus and Gemini or Gemini in them, either one connected to the Chinese year of the dragon and this year 2024 so that's that one let's see what else you need to know two more messages so we've got one and I need another one for all Capricorn right now and there's the other one right so it says a heart-to-heart -heart conversation honestly discussing this honestly discussing your feelings with each other is going to make you understand each other better but it, it is a true sort of heart-to-heart -heart conversation is really needed at this point in time and it says make the effort um, a great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take so make the effort how beautiful is that now finally let's see what you need to know one message from the Chinese cookies but for now for all Capricorn and there it is let's have a look and see what it is right it says manifestations a bountiful time awaits you your wishes could manifest right before your eyes a bountiful time awaits you your wishes could manifest right before your eyes there's plenty coming there's a lot of fortune with this a bounty time means a time of abundance coming where you are going to be thriving there is so much that you are going to be there is a new source of income there is a lot of money coming in and there are miracles pouring into your life also remember that so not only hard work is going to pay off but you've got fortune you've got the fortune cookie folded by clever which is all about great fortune i'll put it up here great good fortune and then you've got a time of bounty and miracles all together to show you that something magnificent is coming and that is the end of your reading for right now, my dear Capricorn. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helps you understand where you're at. I do feel that a lot of truth, a lot of clarity will give you um, an epiphany or two, an understanding. There is that aha moment and there is a lucrative idea that brings you a new source of income. Someone very supportive, hand in hand with you. There is fire energy here. This fire energy could be someone that's not quite happy or leaving or there is an Aries involved in this situation star sign Aries there is someone that's unhappy and leaving but there is a challenge that will be overcome and there could be a reunion and there could be someone new wonderful coming into your life but I feel like there is a very strong earth energy coming in your life Virgo Taurus Capricorn like yourself hope you enjoyed the reading do give me a thumbs up let me know what you think and I wish you abundance of blessings namaste